as we continue to teach more of the print-on-demand business, we want to lay a solid foundation. That's what we've come to realize is how to do that better. So we want to lay a solid foundation of merch because we feel like that's kind of what we built this group on and then start educating you guys on more print-on-demand platforms. If you understand the Wingman five-step test on how to find landing zones, you should be able to easily take that and apply it to the KDP business. We want to show you guys exactly how to do that. The same information that you should be gathering from the shirts, and I say this all the time, testing, <laughs> not guessing. When you start testing and finding out what's working, then it's much easier to build on top of that. That's what we're trying to think about the teaching business bigger and in a way that each piece of teaching is not like, oh, now they're talking about KDP. Now I got to learn a whole nother. It should be just another thing that you add to your business. You should be bolting all of this onto your business. We have figured out a good way to make it work in our business. We're constantly tightening it up to make it work better for us. But as far as like, if you're doing a merch business, it should not be that difficult to add KDP to your business. That's why we're trying to start talking more about the print on demand business as a whole. Yeah. And like Steven said, all those teachings should uh, compound yes. on each other. Um, it will be a learning curve to get into that new system and wrap your head around exactly what's going on. But as far as the research and the art, like we're using similar tools for both of those. We're using similar methods of going after, you know, where we're finding competition. Again, we talked about the five-step test just last Wednesday. So definitely go back and watch that video if you haven't. Uh, but, you know, all of this stuff we want to tie together. And then, you know, we have an even bigger picture of where we want to take this, which is the product line. So once you understand, you know, traffic and how to provide a product for that traffic, just taking that to the next level uh, and building something that's a little bit more uh, cemented, I guess. Business to me is just a bunch of systems. I'm going to call back to McDonald's because I think everybody <laughs> kind of knows that. McDonald's has a really good system. They might not make the best burger you've ever tasted, but it's a very systemized way that they can make the burgers, the fries, and everything. That's what we want to teach you is how to run a business. If you're learning merch and you're understanding it, you should be able to build a system to the point where you can hand it off to somebody else to do. Your job as a business owner is to understand that system and then have somebody else run that system so that you can work on your business, not in your business. That's what we're hopefully growing towards. We want to show you guys how to actually grow businesses and run businesses. If you're just here for merch, I think now is the perfect time because we are trying to lay a solid merch foundation. But we also want you guys to take this journey with us and grow just a print-on-demand business. We feel like if you are doing merch and you understand merch, it's not that difficult to run an actual print-on-demand business. And I don't think this should be a surprise to anybody. Merch is changing all the time. You don't want to give your whole business one income stream and solely rely on Amazon. That is a foolish endeavor. That's why we now are trying to give you multiple options, multiple income streams so that you can grow a successful business, a table with more than just one leg so it can stand on its own, even if some legs sometimes get taken away due to whatever Amazon has going on, you're not crippled in your business. You don't have to start completely over. You have a foundation that you can now build off of. Yeah, we do talk about Amazon a lot, and it's just because it's a fantastic place to find organic traffic um, and, you know, be able to sell products in a pretty systemized way. But it's definitely not the only place to be doing print on demand. It's not the only platform that we're using. Um, and, you know, even doing organic traffic is not the only way of selling print on demand shirts, which, again, we'll talk about more this year. I know we said it a lot last year, like next year, next year it's coming. Uh, but understanding how we can not only, you know, lay that solid foundation of merch, but also package it in a way that it makes sense. And you can like go through it. Like uh, Melinda was saying, like with the scout badges, like it's not quite that system, but we want everything that we're teaching to build on top of each other instead of it just being everywhere. Like, oh yeah, you want to learn art? Here's the art class, but you're also going to learn that in every you know course that we go through because we want you to understand these basic um, you know, tools and things to use to actually make sure you can get shirts up and do all this stuff. So, Hey guys, thanks for checking out the video. My name is Steven. This is my brother, Nathaniel. Together, we are the Wingman. If you guys want to know more about anything that we talked about, check the description of this video.